Hello and welcome back to another short news video for Final Fantasy XIV with me, Mioni. This time we're talking about a brand new tweet that was posted today, the 14th of August 2020, by the official Final Fantasy XIV English Twitter account. Now, specifically, they are talking about adding a lodestone update for this later, but it was so important they wanted to address people on Twitter and obviously other social media sources as well directly before they did a proper write-up. So it's pretty useful, actually, and I'm, I'm really not, uh, I'm really grateful that they're actually doing this as well. It's a, it's a great, great way of communicating with people. So it says, A message from Naoki Yoshida regarding the new high-quality turn-in feature and housing situation. So quite an interesting uh, discussion. I think you'll agree. Um, so yeah, this is producer and director Naoki Yoshida, essentially, and they've basically written this up from what he said it's not a direct quote so they say number one a checkbox for the high quality turn-ins was added for grand companies and leave or levy quests however you pronounce that to make it more apparent for new players but this has greatly lowered the efficiency of turn-ins this then will be removed in a hot fix at the end of august so sometime towards the end of august we'll be seeing a hot fix where that will no longer be a thing. That's quite an interesting change. Um, a lot of people went to the forums and did actually, you know, express how it is incredibly inefficient when you're turning in like 30 things to actually uh, have that checkbox for high quality turn-ins. So um, it might have been a cool idea, but sometimes quality of life changes such as adding that actually results in less quality of life. So it's nice to see that they're directly responding to feedback and they can see that it was actually a step backwards. So that will be changed before the end of August. And me personally, I think that's really positive to see. So thank you, Square Enix, for listening to our feedback. But number two, then, it says, While we are very grateful for the increase in players due to the new updates, the housing demolition timer has remained disabled due to COVID-19. We are planning to add more plots soon... But due to the current situation, the installation process has been slowed down. We apologize for the inconvenience caused. The full details of this announcement is currently being prepared. Thank you for your patience. So presumably there'll be a lodestone update with all of this information, just probably with more words. But essentially, this is all we really need to see that, um, yeah, they are planning to add new housing plots. Um, I'm not sure personally, in my opinion, that adding more pl plots will be a long-term solution for the amount of players that actually are playing the game. Um, but I might be wrong, you guys might disagree with that. I'm interested to see what you might think would be a good solution to the housing situation. Of course, a lot of people are under the impression that one day we might get the Ishgard restoration housing, so housing in Ishgard. Um, that's still yet to be confirmed fully, and it's just all rumour at the moment. So, presumably, if they were to add the, the Ishgard housing, they would add plots at the same time. It, it seems to me like a logical, you know, not too, not too much of a problematic jump to presume then that they would do that in accordance to that. It would make the most sense. It would also increase the amount of plots overall, not just in the current areas like they love to do every time they do this, but also give people what they want in that regard. And um, maybe that's what they're going to do. Or are they just simply going to add new plots? That'll we'll have to wait and see. But they say we are planning to add more plots soon. Soon to me, I mean, could be all the way up until 5.4. It could be 5.35. It could be all the way till Christmas. We just don't know yet. But for any updates, I will be sure to keep you notified because housing is a significant thing uh, for quite a lot of people, as much as some people try to deny it. And uh, there is a shortage of it, especially on the higher population servers. So anyway, let me know what you think the solution would be to the housing situation and the crisis, let's call it, because that's literally what it is. And uh, what you would do, what you would implement. Would you immediately try to implement some kind of instance housing system? Would you go for something broader? But for the time being, I think it's going to be mostly a uh, short term solution will be obviously to keep the current way it's it's going and uh, just to add more plots is that going to answer much it depends really how on how many plots i think you'll probably agree anyway let me know below in the comment section i look forward to engaging with you there thank you kindly for watching a link to this source will be in the description of the video and i'll see you all next time